In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to add autocomplete text box in Asp.NET C Sharp with SQL Server. If you don't subscribe my channel yet, please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for upcoming videos. This is the item type column. I will display item name based on item type in autocomplete text box. See that item type: yarn, chemical dyes, accessories. And this is the design. I will add a drop down list for item type. In the previous tutorial, you can see how to uh, add autocomplete text box in ASP.NET C Sharp using Azox Toolkit. Okay, so select item type and add a drop down list from the toolbox. Yes, drop down list name is drop down list 1. White is 13 pixel yes the enable auto pushback yes now this is the CS file first of all I'm declaring a session variable session item type equal to drop down list one dot selected value yes now add the item drop down list item items are accessories chemicals dyes and yarns yarn okay add higher close mm, it will be added in higher close item name item type item type is item type item t y p e item type equal to single quotation double quotation then plus sign then i will call session variable to call session variable i must add http context so http context dot current dot session session variable is item type let's check yes this is the item type just copy and paste it in the session http context okay now it's done I just right click and begin browser yes now it's not displaying the item name select yarn now put item name yarn item name yes you can see it's autocomplete text box is working fine let's check yes this is that this is the item type yarn item name is 10 single 12 single okay now if I select chemicals it displaying all the items which item type is chemical now I'm gonna add percentage before add the text to display the item which contain the text what I put in the autocomplete text box so reload this page yes now put yarn if I put to one it display 10 single 20 double and everything what is contained in yarn items name okay these all are yarn item If I select chemical, then see that when I put I and it displaying industrial salt and for all the items which exist I n in same as ten which exist ten it displaying all the item chemical item and in accessories displaying C A it displaying paper carton Mr. Carton C A all the item which exist see uh, in the items of accessories okay thanks for watching this tutorial